Richard, we'll start off tonight with the news of your new promotion at the club. How could you tell us about that? Yeah, it was just an opportunity arose, obviously, with Alan Archibald moving on. And I spoke to the manager and, uh, before we came back pre-season and he asked if I would I'd want to step up and, and be the lead development coach, which essentially kind of gets me in anywhere between the 18s and, and reserves um, and then helping out in that match day with the first team. So it was it was an opportunity I was never going to say no to. Um, it's a fantastic opportunity for me. It's great to work with the, the gaffer and, and Fraley as well. So it's um, I find myself in a good place and I was I was delighted to be offered. Well, congratulations. Back to the game tonight. What was your take on the match? It's disappointing. Overriding feelings disappointing. Any cup competition, you want to do well, you want to uh, you want to play well, you want to perform. And I don't think we gave ourselves a chance of, of ever doing anything in the game. I don't think the goalkeeper had a save to make. Or if he did, it was, it was very little, nothing of note. Um, I thought we lacked a lot of quality in the final areas. Lots of endeavour from the, the guys. Um, but no real quality going forward and I think when, when you struggle to pass the ball 10 yards to your teammates you're never going to cause a team problems especially a team who you know have done well last season um, but yeah the overriding feeling is disappointment purely because we never really turned up and we never gave a good account of themselves you know I'm kind of banging on how good those boys can be in that dressing room but these are the games you know it's, it's a cup game there's a crowd it's, it's got a bit of an atmosphere um, and unfortunately we never, we never really turned up how do you rectify that for the rest of the games? Because it is very early in the season. Yeah, it's very early, and you know I've I've said to them, my message to them is they won't be judged on on winning and losing games. You know it's about the development. If they're better players at the end of the season than they are right now, then that to me is is, is progress. That to me is an achievement. But still, you know you have to have that within yourself that you want to win games. I can't give that to any of the players. They need to have that themselves. And and to be fair, I think they've got it. But I, I I think I don't think they can kind of to marry the, the endeavour with the, the quality at the moment and it's just it's work on the training pitch it's, it's get you know get back to basics get them passing the ball get them touching the ball um, it's you know I think we, we sometimes we go too quickly we try and give them tactical stuff because you know we try and get them ready for the first team but at the end of the day if they can't pass the ball um, which they couldn't tonight then that's something I need to look at and I need to work on and I need to hammer at home that even when they're away from the club they need to be practising. I can't be with them all the time. They're only at the club well, they're a few hours a, a day. Um, they need to want it more themselves and they need to, to do things on their own to, to improve their own standards. It was a young side tonight with a number of new faces that have came in this summer that signed professional contracts. How excited are you about this, this batch of players? <laughs> Before tonight? <laughs> no, I'm very excited. I think they're a good group. They're good to work with. I think they just, they're coming to terms with a lot of new things. You know, we're training probably four or five times as much as they were before and um, they're in the gym way more than they are before so they're dealing with a lot of things so you, you've got to give them allowances for that um, but I'm more disappointed for them because I know that, that they've got quality I see it on a daily basis I see, I've seen it in games last season with the 16s I've seen them step up to the 18s and, and tonight they never showed it and that's the disappointing thing so you know they're young it's it's you know the fledging uh, career so it's it, there's no big drama I think they can they've more than enough time to put things right um, but I would have just liked to, to give them a better account of them, themselves tonight but unfortunately they didn't do that but you say back to the training training pitch on Thursday and we start again and, and try and improve Thanks for your time Richard